Yeah, it was a bit different. Um, it was good because we had the practice match against them too, so that sort of got the nerves away. But um, yeah, it was good. A few of the boys tried to get stuck into me, but I just sort of took it on the chin, and it was good to um, play some good footy against them. And um, Spion, we didn't come along, uh, come away with the win, but um, we did do a lot of things right and um, got a lot to take away from it. Um, well, I'm sure he's mature enough to sort of know how to go about things, but um, he played some good footy last week, Brock, and I'm sure he'd be right. Yeah, I suppose we're pretty hard on it. We don't want any information leaked out, so oh, I haven't looked much into it, so there's not much really I can say. Yeah, he's had an exceptional year already, so um, he's a pretty passionate guy through and through, like on and off the field, so um, we want him to stay the way he plays his footy and stay like just keep playing good footy. Um, we did speak about what he did and um, how it looks off the field, like for all the media and stuff, and we did address it, so we probably nailed it on the head. Oh, I'm not saying don't do it, just sort of keep it at a level that is acceptable. And um, we love his passion, so we can't keep that from him. I suppose just backing myself. Um, I played a lot of VFL down at um, Geelong, and to get the opportunity and, have, and them to have faith in me to play at the highest level has been great. And um, I suppose at the start was trying to get to know all the boys and how they play. And as a backline, we're pretty we're pretty tight down there now, so. Um, there hasn't been many ins and outs except for Simon White and Brett Thornton, but um, yeah, I suppose just um, backing myself and trying to beat my direct opponent.